Hey everyone, my name is Matt. Welcome back to our home renovation remodel series thing. There's Donovan. Welcome back to window installation day two. The most exciting moment since a long time. Long time. <laughs> so in the last episode, we got these five main windows in the sunroom installed. And then previous to that, we got the door installed. Today, big moment as we're gonna put in the last three windows. We got the two on this end, and then we have the smaller one which goes in over here. And that's gonna take care of all of the window installation for ever. Ever, this entire project, right? Yep. We're depending done. On how you have them, it could be five or forty-five windows, depending on how your math does. Yeah, you know. <laughs> Hopefully, your math is better today. It wasn't good the other day. <laughs> seventeen total windows installed. This is seventeen windows and a door. And a door. Perfect. We actually One got reuse. That's sixteen new. Sixteen new windows. And we reuse. reuse that one in, 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 on the. Yep. On the gable or on the got the gable end of the great room. Yeah, so that. That window in the great room used to be right there, and now it's around the corner in there. So I don't know. I'm pretty. I'm excited because this is going to be. Oh, it's been a very slow progression for the well, last. while has been a little bit painful. <laughs> so I'm I'm personally very happy to be at this point where we're like, there are noticeable changes day to day. <laughs> you you warned me about that, but I didn't quite. You didn't, you didn't sink in all the way? No. No, no, no. <laughs> Well, we've had, we've had a bunch of delays, too. I mean, because of, the, I mean, with the this whole month was kind of a... That was last month. We're in a new month now. Next, yeah, last month we lost. <laughs> I mean, we're kind of where I thought we would be a month, a month ago. Yeah. Just because of the weather and not being able to move forward on stuff. Yeah, so we've been waiting for waiting for things and weather. It's it's been yeah. It's we're like a month out because I think at the beginning of the month we were setting the post for that little roof edition, the porch edition over there. We're like, we're gonna get going, we're gonna get this done, and then it was raining and it snowing rained, and it rained and snow for like a couple weeks and then cold weather. So we're yeah. gonna have forty degree dry. Yeah. Put the roof on. Which is on. So we're gonna cut out some more OSB and slam some glass in here. And I'm just I'm ecstatic to finally see this coming. This is, yeah, it's gonna look like, look like the picture, yeah. finally. I think so. One of the realizations we had yesterday is that we'll be able to see through the whole house from the dining room. Yeah. Like that's that's cool. That'll work. We have to get around the corner and turn it up. Uh, yeah. Just, just, barely. just barely, but yeah. I think so. Don't lean here. Don't yeah, don't lean in there either. <laughs> that, that'd be bad.
I can see you again. I can see you. I see you. Yeah. <laughs> Clingy. This is a little, long. That's a, little <laughs> a little overkill on the sides. I think that was the second one I cut. <laughs> uh-huh. There's something like oddly satisfying about seeing it just like fan around the corner. <laughs> I don't know what, oh hi pancake. <laughs> Maybe windows after you do the flap? Do the flap? Flip the, flip the flap? Flip the flap up. We'll flip the flap. Pop the hood. And we'll stick the window. <laughs> don't drop it. No drop your window. Are you sure you want me to help you put that up yeah. in the... Please don't hurt your back. Take get the flange out? Yeah. Not, not yet, no. No, um, now it is, yep. Okay, going back in. Okay. Okay. And then... What's happening up here? You want the size out? No, 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 just the top. We're just going to put it screw at the top. Okay, it's out. And let's put a tack in that. Got it? Yep, I got it. It's going to be a little more challenging trying to get... Why is this so much? What? Things so much bigger. I guess it's not. It just seems like it's bigger. What do you mean, like bigger than the opening? Yeah. Well, the jam, the extension jams probably make it look, well, actually, it does look kind of... It's tight at the bottom. It's, I, it's, it's actually okay. It's just like, it looks... It might well, be maybe it's just... Yeah. I don't know. I think it's... It's probably just deceiving because you're used to the extension jam. We're going to go all the way out with it. Can you get the flap down? It's down. Okay. Up and in. Good. Yep. Out, cover the top. Okay. Okay. Woo! Done. We don't need to do any more than that. That's it. So just like last time, we're using our laser again. It's still set from uh, previously. Oh, it's a little bit different. So on here we have these extension jams already installed for this two by six wall. But since we have a wall thickness here is 10 a quarter, these don't have the factory extension jams on here. We're gonna make our own full jam extension on here. So we lowered the laser just a little bit. So instead of picking up the top of the extension jam or the bottom of the extension jam, we're now in here onto the actual window casing. And that's what we're going to line up our windows out here with. Just a little bit of a different spot on the window. So this right here 
is the same as this right here. So with the laser set, now we can get our up and down position correct. And the only other small detail is making sure they are in the right position left to right. So our casings all end up spot dead on. We have this, we have this fun detail <laughs> where the two casings, the door and the window casing meet dead smack in the middle of the switches. And we already set the switch. And the switch box is there already. So now the windows get set to the switch box. And the switch box is set by the door. And everything is set by the door. According to that, let me just go that way. Three eighths of an inch. I'm going to push that side back in, the bottom. How, is out a lot? It came out a lot. I moved it over. Go ahead and go ahead and pull the top for a second. Good? Yep, you're loose. Okay, go ahead and get that pushed all back in. I think that's where I want to be. Okay, you got the window? Oh, oh was that far out? Holy crap. Yeah, it was really far out. Okay, that was a lot further than I thought. Okay, that's still good for now. Yeah. Go ahead and set a uh, tack. A tack at the top. I'm just trying to get side to side to see where we're at. Okay. Was this side? Your side got to go in at the bottom still. Yeah, like a little, like that. Yep. The better. That's better. And why don't you put one down at that corner? The bottom, down here. Yeah. Actually, get these in. Leave them a little bit. So if we have to go side to side a little bit. Fold that out. So let's. And go over a quarter inch. I think if you go over, it's not going to be much meat. I know to grab it's going to be pretty close. Right. I got it. I got it. Was the bottom got a screw in it or not? Uh, not on this one. No. Yeah, no. I mean, it's going to be, you go over a quarter inch, and that's going to be right at the seam. All right. We're pretty, pretty darn close to it. All right. Oh, it's going to go over, right? Huh? Well, it's we going to go, go over, over? It's going to go over three eighths. Then, yeah, three quarters is fine. Okay. <clears throat> okay, I got it. Yeah, that last little bit's gonna be a. Yeah. Can you get it with a multi tool or something? Don't put your head into that. Like. Did I miss the screw? Oh, we stapled it on. Oh my god. I forgot about that part. Okay, we had a small issue with our rough openings that has been resolved now. So we didn't have enough this way movement. So <laughs> this filler came out, planed down even further, and we added another filler on this side to move the entire rough opening this way. Just a, just a little bit. A quarter inch. A quarter inch moving framing. <laughs> Some people are going to love that one. Okay, now we try and do this again. Okay, the bottom's got to come out. Can you pull the bottom? Yep, hang on. Okay, it's out. Is it all the way back now? Nope. There no, it go. is. Better? Three and three quarters. Three and three quarters. Oh, oh. I think that's where we're going to be. We might have even casing all the way around the room. 
it's going to be, <laughs> somebody's going to come in with a micrometer to get, get the difference. <laughs> That's, <laughs> so they just have to be, I'll mark them where they, I want, side to side on the bottom. Mm -hmm. um, we'll put some caulking around there, screw them in. Here we go. <clears throat> This corner is high, or that that side is low. Whatever you want. You know what? Go ahead and screw it right there. All right. Recheck your your diagonal and check your level, but that should be pretty. I mean, I must have a, a bag that's busted. Is it leaking? This one keeps leaking. Diagonal's still good. Okay. That's very level. Okay. <laughs> Let's just put a couple more in it just to get it secure. Okay. Everything's That's good? Very plumb. Okay. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh. Made it. Made it. That was. Ha <laughs> ha. All right, can you check it for the top for level? Oh, it's the level's on the inside here. Check the top for level. You got it? I mean, it's pretty good. If, I mean, the out, if this can go up a little bit, but I don't think you really need to if you don't have to. Okay. It's actually not bad. Uh, can you go ahead and set one on the top of each one? Try it now. Pretty close. Okay. How about the level then? Yeah, that's pretty close. In that direction. Check the level on the top, and if that's good, let's put some screws in it. Yeah. Let's put some screws in it. I need to check one more dimension down below here. Do you want to wait? Yep. Or you get too carried away? I get carried away easily. We're 16th off. Screw it. <laughs> screw it. Literally screw that thing. <laughs> it's nice in the sun. Well, you can do either or because I got we're going right in, so I don't I gotta do them all anyway, I guess, huh? Yep. I'll do this side. Is the bottom in? Yeah, the bottom's out. There you go. It's real sucky now. Yeah. All right, can you put a tack in that? I think it's got to go up just ever so slightly. Uh, I left the right. How are we there? Um, I think we're pretty close. I gotta, I'm not, I gotta measure that, but I want to get it. That'll probably hold. That'll hold it for now.
Good enough? That's right on. Let's set some screws in it. You can feel the outside. You're right there. Check it out, we got a wall of windows, or a couple walls of windows, I guess. All installed. Oh wow, yeah, that's, that makes a big difference. Even just a little window, I mean, it's like a small window, but it's like, Yeah, this is, this is a lot of glass. <laughs> it's a lot of glass. 144 square feet of glass. That's the size of a bedroom. Plus a door. Plus a door. <laughs> In glass. In just glass. Back here. Ah, yeah, this is... We need more... This is not enough windows up here. No, should we make it bigger? Should we make this bigger? Let's make this hole bigger? It finally happened. They're finally here. They're finally in the holes. <laughs> oh. oh, we got it. It's uh, May 3rd. May 3rd. It's only a month late. I'm like giving birth to a starfish. <laughs> I don't know anything about that. <laughs> it's been painful. It's, it's, it's been a journey. Oh, boy. So our box is now a box with a bunch of glass holes in it. For the rest of the day, we're gonna do a little tidying up and get some of the stuff out of the way so we can get an even better idea of what this is really gonna look like without a bunch of scaffolding or construction stuff in view. And after a little bit of cleanup, I think having the scaffold and stuff out of here gives a uh, much better perspective on what this is all gonna look like starting to look like a real thing now <laughs> it's pretty crazy so there's all the uh east windows there's the one south window there's a nice window well this is where the future steps onto the deck into the uh sunroom is going to be there's a bump out for the dining room where the sideboard will go as we come in here, we have all this wonderful light over here. And then there's the pantry. Going to the breakfast area, into the kitchen. There's those front windows. All the way to the front of the house. Look out there. We'll spin around. And there is just a ton of light coming in from that side. Previously, here's those windows we did in the great room. So those are quite a bit bigger than they were before, but still, <laughs> still no match for what's going on over here. Good morning, everyone. Uh, it's incredible. <laughs> the, uh, the sun coming in there this morning was absolutely beautiful. And like when the sun is that low in the sky in the morning, the sun comes in all the way across the room. It's going to come all the way into the kitchen area. And I think it's going to be an absolutely incredible space uh, every morning. The other nice thing that I did yesterday is you can just stand here in the sunroom and you can let the kids go play and do whatever they want. And you can watch them from inside, <laughs> which is uh, very nice. So yesterday we ran out of screws. So uh, a couple little things here to finish up today. 
finish uh, screwing off all the windows that need more screws, and then we'll tape the remaining ones, finish up the Tyvek. We need to tie in some Tyvek up top, tie in some Tyvek down the bottom here. And uh, that should be about it for installing all the windows everywhere. <laughs> everywhere. There's those two. <laughs> almost, almost nothing compared to these. <laughs> I thought those were big. Not so much. Okay, so there we go. We got all the solder windows are installed. What is the magic window number? Did you decide? Goes to 11. <laughs> 17 okay. windows we've set. We're done setting windows now. One exterior door, 15 new windows, or 15 of these Marvin windows, and then those two uh, other ones, which I forget the name of those manufacturer ones, but anyway. That's a, that's a lot of glass and it's looking really good. Now one thing that Donovan was telling me was we're at this transition point in the project. We're going from all the, the rough stuff to essentially finishing stuff uh, at this point. So we're getting into the it's all trim phase. It's all trim. <laughs> Out here is going to be all trim all the way around. We'll have a bit of siding over here, but otherwise all of that's trim on the outside and the inside, and we have our deck to build out here. So it's gonna be uh, a lot of fun finishing stuff as we move forward and get everything actually looking like something that's not a construction box thing. <laughs> so that's gonna do it for this one. Thank you as always for watching. We greatly appreciate it. If you have any questions or comments on the home renovation remodel edition thingy with Bob, whatever you wanna call it, please feel free to leave us a comment. As always, we'll be happy to answer any questions you might have. And until next time, happy woodworking. <laughs>